Hey guys, welcome back to part 11, 12, I don't know, 13, who knows. And I do not remember what I did in the last video because it's been a few days, literally. Um, so yeah, no fucking clue. I know my wife has left me, the family's all gone. Ah, fuck it. Oh, uncle. That's not the name in your file, Michael. Steve Haynes here. Agent douchebag. Hey, that poor son bitch we grabbed for you still breathing? See for yourself right now. Trevor Phillips is on his way to help with the debrief. Warehouse off Dutch London and Banning. Great. Sounds just like my kind of party. All right. So yeah, we we grabbed a guy supposedly uh, for the FBI. We fucking abseiling down a building and shit. So now we're gonna go interrogate him. Man. Oh fuck off. So, I swear they've got the same car as me. Man, Trevor and interrogation. Man, that's right up his street by the sound of it. But I don't know if he's going to be doing the interrogation, but he's going to be present, so it's going to be interesting. Well, I've got to become Trevor. Ah. Hold on. Oh, shit. What the fuck am I doing? So I assume I'm Trevor now? Well, I had to become him, so fuck it. What the fuck? Sweet Jesus. What the hell are you doing? Nothing. Are you taking a dump? Ah, why do you care, huh? The fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> I've got abandonment issues. I see a shrink once a week. You know, fuck you. Yeah, well, you know. Nothing like meeting a bunch of creeps from the government in a quiet building for someone to grow balls. Just see his face that last time I popped him. Boom! Oh, ladies! God, asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you? You, I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> he reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get arrested. <laughs> hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> than a tail catcher. <laughs> I have to fucking remember that line. <laughs> yeah, fuck's sake. Where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Hey, keep the sleep best of the way from me. No, oh, no, no, Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael. And this. This is Trevor. No. Now, our friend here. He claims he doesn't know anything. I don't, I don't know anything. I don't know. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please. Please. Sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, hi-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price. VIP. No? You're a so. fucking spy. <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. So I need to know. What did you tell them, and what did they tell you? I, I, told, hmm? I told them what I tell you. Uh huh. What? I. Hey. This whoa, whoa, whoa! What is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two are gonna him. drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. Because no, 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 I'm tired of these fucking nitwits at the agency taking all the glory. Let me go. Hey, right, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know? Go for a drive. No, you get to work, and uh, I'm not here. Shit. Caesar's place, Rockford Hills. Okay, so just to recap, <coughs> one of the previous videos, we kidnapped this guy from the agency, a rival agency, 
And now this agency who we're working for, because we're forced to at this point, um, wants to know what he told them and they told him. And now we're torturing him. So, yes, and out of everyone to torture somebody, I mean, if it weren't bad enough in itself, you got Trevor, the kind of man that fucking enjoys that kind of shit. Or kind of thinks up ways daily to do that kind of crap, you know what I mean? Oh, man. So, I'm going to take this car. Quite slick. Nice. So, I let Trevor get on with that. In the meantime, we can be trying to find whatever this guy, whoever this guy is. see if your boss, the more I like him. I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him... Hey! If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo -hoo for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley... Watch it! Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. Which is worse. <laughs> any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or? Or? We stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away. The FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away, the second he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Town. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. <coughs> Sorry, I'm just really intrigued in the story there. I still want to keep Trevor in the dark about how long I've been working with the FBI. <coughs> Avoid his anger issues. <laughs> don't want him sparking up and ruining everything thus far. And he's already involved and we don't really want that to begin with anyway, so... We're trying to cover each other's asses. <coughs> Also, it would seem anyway at this point. Jesus Come on, let's just hope we can get there. Fucking hell. See, the thing with this game is again, I don't want to crash like I normally would because I don't want the police on me and it takes 20 minutes to get them off me. It's fucking shit. So. I know I've complained a lot in the past few videos about it, but it kind of kills the game to me because you can't have any fun. You can't just wreck it. You've got to go proper, proper. But whatever. I mean, maybe that's just my opinion. Maybe I haven't mastered getting the police off my back. Alright, so where are we at? Bullshit. This place. David, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, you sure you don't silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Hmm. In the meantime, to find the target, torture Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Wait. What about the wrong guy? No. Who do you want? Mr. K has pushed too far. He may need to adrenaline shot. Look at me, please. Hmm. I can't legally tell you to do this, but do it. I know Azerbaijanis. Let's see. We can start off with saying small. Whatever you want, huh? You'll barely feel a thing. I will. I will. Be gentle. I'm rude. 
Hmm. Oh. Fuck. Phillips, ask him about Tay here. Java. Why didn't you ask me? I know Tay here. I did his home theater. He lives in Chumash, right into the Western Highway. Oh, that wasn't so tough, was it? Huh? <laughs> did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash, the Western Highway. That was it. You're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. <laughs> that was pretty simple. I was going to work my way up the ladder and probably end with the fire. I mean, the uh, petrol <coughs> can, you know what I mean? But oh well. So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. Now, well, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of it. Then what? This thing with the agency. Don't! This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job, no casualties. There were more eyes on that town than there needed to be. Yeah, well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he <laughs> thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh. So that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad. Who he thinks is locked up in high security and not... Well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Townley. The trainees write them. It's a good exercise. Yeah, the fuck. How'd that get started? A few years ago, a letter came to the federal prison system addressed to Brad. It wasn't signed, but it gave a P.O. box in Sandy Shores. I played the part of Brad and we started a correspondence. Yeah, thanks for telling me, Davey. Wow. Doing you a favor. Didn't think you want to know he was in the same state. Yeah, so now what? I just sit back and hope he doesn't figure it out? It's worked so far. He's a time bomb, Dave. And you fucking know it. Wow, that's crazy. That is absolutely insane. So they've been writing him letters, tricking him all these years. He's going to be fucking fuming at that shit. That is not good. Right, we're here. This'll do. Alright. Find out who we're looking for. Yeah, we need a description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. Oh, no, no, please. I tell what? you what you Loosen want him to up! Know. No, please. Alright. We're back on the torture. <sighs> I said loose. My teeth are perfect. Oh. I just have the blazer. Oh, oh man. Right? Hold the grip of tooth. Rotate. Oh. Ah, that's gonna kill. Hey, well, you ain't gonna be chewing steak anytime soon. Get out of here. Uh, maybe we shouldn't have done that because he needs to talk. Oh well. Hey, 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 hey! Now, huh? Now you ready to talk? I got kidnapped. This thing That's what we were afraid of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy we're after. What does he look like? I was built. I was like middle age. Yeah, yeah. It sounds like you're stalling. This better be enough. Middle age, middle height, middle build, whatever. He's dark, okay? He's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around. That enough for you? Find the target. He's dark. What? He's middle aged? <sighs> okay, how am I supposed to. Stanley, what do you see? I see a couple guys that are way too old and too fat to be doing a political assassination. Let's keep it objective, okay? What's in the scope? When I need analysis, I'll call a pundit. There's a party, alright?
I can't do shit. Matter here. Up the magnification. Ah, what the fuck? Oh, there we are. We need eyes in the room. We're live. You see anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? Fuck do I know? You might be an Azerbaijani for all I know. What's one look like? They look Eastern. Half this town looks Eastern, Davy. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, <laughs> Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. Switch to Trevor. Okay. <coughs> Looks like we're gonna have to start using the electrics. Sorry, too late, Trevor. Show our contestant what he's won today. I remember. I remember. I remember. All right. This will put hair on your chest. We'll take it off. Not the clip. Yes, indeed. I feel sorry for this motherfucker. All right, hold L2 of a clip and all right, a clip. <laughs> Don't kill him. I think he's getting a stiffy. <laughs> so what have you got for us? Hmm? We need Trev to shake up your memory again? No, 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 Beard, no, 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 Got any beardy types at this party? Huh? Bushy beard, all right. Mr. K's given us. No, no. You know, I'm thinking maybe we uh, just take two bullets and put them in our Please, no. and just call an airstrike on Chumash Beach. I need eyes on that party. Pick up the scope and give me a report. Beard. Who am I looking for? Steve saying beard. What do you got? Anything specific or is some stubble going to cut it? Let's start at Mountain Men and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. Oh, oh God. Party. Vinewood's full of weak chins. Place is famous for it. Damn. Beards are in fashion in Chumash. Land of beach hipsters. We need more. Son of a bitch. Alright, so we're going back to Sky. Come on, fucker. Tell us all the information, then you won't get tortured. This looks like a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, maybe one more time? Just to be sure. No, please, no. Huh? I told you, he smokes. That's all I know. He smokes. That's not good enough, man. <sighs> Nothing to complain about here, pal. This is totally legit. It's a torture. It is. I was wrong. But it's not gasoline. Torture. It's um, waterboarding. Gives the sensation that you're drowning. It's not. Yeah, here we are. It's not good. It's uh, CIA torture. The survey out there used to do this to terrorists. Now they uh, abandoned it or said it wasn't legal or ethical. No one wants this shit. He's had enough. Help me pick this up. Let me up. <laughs> Let me up. Today's lesson. It's about government regulation. <laughs> this is meaningless. <laughs> Mr. K. <laughs> Mr. K. I don't know anything, please. <laughs> okay. He chain smokes. And he's left handed. What's that? He chain smokes. And he's left handed. Ah, okay. <laughs> Any of these bearded guys at the party smoke cigarettes? Mr. K says he smokes like a pack of two a day. Redwood cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Redwood cigarettes. He's telling me he chain smokes redwoods. It ain't the cigarettes that'll kill him. It's the guys who put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. And he's left handed. Oh, now I get it. You're Did he snow in? He's a guy because he's got facial hair, a cigarette, and he's left handed. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest, details. So I'm thinking it's this guy here, or this out uh, of these two. Ah, oh, come on.
I swear to God, I just want to kill all of them. Chain smokes left handed. Well, I'm going to get this so wrong. Fucking redwood cigarettes, like what the fuck? Two guys here as well. I'm not seeing anything specific with them. Like, they've got a fag or what? <sighs> this shit is so annoying. I'm gonna take a chance and just fucking Michael, what the fuck is wrong with you? What I had my eyes on a target. Listen, anyone in that joint's got as much chance of being a threat to national security as the next guy. Steve, it's blown. Fuck it. So it wasn't the guy in red. I mean on the left. <laughs> well, I just had to take a chance, you know what I mean? Telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. <laughs> I will go down the list one by one. Michael, what the fuck is wrong with you? Right, that's him. <coughs> Anyone in that joint's got as much chance of being a threat hmm. to national security as the next guy. Steve, it's blown. <coughs> <coughs> well, it wasn't him. And it ain't that dude. <laughs> I just couldn't see verification. Assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest. We don't even have an ID. Why are you shooting before we have an ID? You Fuck it. The and that guy didn't die. I think alright and that's him. I was thinking he was smoking. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. Ah, I see someone. There is. What the hell? That was the guy. I had a feeling. It'll check <laughs> out. Michael, what the fuck? Oh fuck! You get kicks out of killing innocent women now. The report I'm gonna have to write. Stevie fucked it. How did I fuck it? <laughs> <coughs> All right, man. I'll just take out the one guy now. I see him. That is funny. Because he's a threat to national security. The rest. Boom! Left-handed smokes beard. The guy. I had a feeling. It'll check out. Well, we've got him. It's done. Woo! That is a wrap, my friend. Good shit. Excellent work, the pair of you. Now I got a racquetball uh, game to get uh, to, so Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. <coughs> what the fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh, come on, please. Shut up! That's a sport. <coughs> Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. Oh, what? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go. Get up. Come on, up the fucking stairs. <laughs> oh, fuck's sakes. Come on. Let's go. All right. Now you got a flight to catch, okay? Let's get you to the airport. <laughs> All right, so we interrogated the dude, found out the information, and now he says kill him, the FBI. But we're not going to do that for whatever reason. In theory, hey, how's your mouth? we're going to send him away. Can you speak? Kind of. Are you going to hold it together? I want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 you have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. Turn <laughs> the 
playing good. I love him very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home. I'm taking you to the airport. You're going to get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country, and you're going to spread your message. I don't have a message. You're a torture advocate. Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We need it to get information, to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything. Exactly. Tortures for the torturer. Or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times. We should all admit that. It's useless as a means of getting information. I'm feeling lightheaded. Sometimes you torture for the torturee, but only if they're prepared to pay. I am very unwell. It's me, 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 me. Jesus Christ, good grief. I thought we really bonded, but now I'm having my doubts. Let's get the fuck out of here. Hate these fucking motorways and shit. The guys had a rough night. <laughs> When the where's it gonna go? That's what I'm interested to see. Departures. No one drives me to the airport. Fucking move, cocksuckers. Here we are. Be... Oh. Run. You're free. Oh, oh, what? But my family is here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here. All right. Now look, trust no one, all right? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on. <laughs> 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 oh, what was that worry? Okay. All right, mission passed. By the book. Oh hell yeah, that was by the book. All right. Fucking hell. Man, I've, still, I've got loads of different areas to go to. B. Barry. Franklin. Hmm. Right, where's the nearest place? Shit, now I kind of know where I am. Hold on. No. Ugh. Oh, fuck. That's where I am. Okay. So, Franklin is the nearest place to go. Ah, so, let's head, over, head on over there. Hey Uncle T, it's Jizzle Jimmy D2 motherfucker S. Glad you are back. My dad has been acting like a wacko. Biatch recently, all angry, shizzle, oh god. Come fucking hell, the way, the way he talks pisses me off. Drives me fucking nuts. Ron, we miss you. Really miss you. Listen, there's all kinds of crazies sniffing about. Hmm. While we're in the city, pr probably people trying to move on in on our territory. Who knows? <coughs> I feel like I should've just got out this fucking car and fucking... Brad. No, it must be an imposter or something. He's dead. I saw a picture of his funeral. I know why. Don't you come here and visit me. Well, Some I'll shit. Yeah. What the fuck am I doing? I'm trying to read these emails and shit. Ah, oh, the driving on this game that pisses me off. That was entirely Bollocks. Whatever. Lucky miss. <coughs> Ah, 
Move. Good Lord above. Oh, fuck off. Oh. Come on. Here we are, Franklin's house, I believe. Jesus. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. <laughs> Franklin's housemate and aunt, my mother's old dried up ass. Shut sister. the fuck up! <laughs> Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Here, darling, why don't you go get yourself something nice? Oh, okay? Thank you. <laughs> is, is it seven dollars? <laughs> you want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. <laughs> Brilliant. What are you doing here? Here with the boy. The boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dog. The fucking thing. I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? <laughs> talking about the little stretch thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. <laughs> man, just come on. So, this is a continuation of the uh, stretch or whatever. And Trevor is bored, essentially. And wants on in. Down Grove Street. i got to be honest with you. Having Trevor with you on doing something illegal or whatever. Spraying some other fuckers. I can drive. It's always going to be very interesting, especially when you're getting revenge on someone who's on your team. That's what I want. Rather have him on my side than be against him. Oh man. Particularly where you are stress concerned. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh. First rule of business. Hey, just since we're out here banging, either you got some dust. Fool want to get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, old boy. Homie's crazy, man. <laughs> so I've heard. <coughs> Homie live up here. Hey, look, everybody be cool, man. The more about to do his thing, all right? <coughs> Go to the house. Courier service. Packets to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted for. <laughs> you like that, huh? Sample? <laughs> now we talking. <laughs> <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now, you heard what your boy said, you're leaving. Hey, give me that. Give me that. Back. Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key? Or a fucking ounce! Man, that's motherfucking drywall! Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here! You can't fucking hustle a hustler! Wow. Drywall. It was a double cross. <laughs> Fuck you. That's fucking insane. Trevor fucking knew it. Actually, no, I can't leave. Move! So, 
there's a neighborhood thing because he had his gang all uh, sticking around. Taking them down. Wow, man, we're getting surrounded. There's fucking loads of them. Right, I've got to become Trevor, apparently. Fucking loads of them. Who's it gonna end? Oh shit, I got a shot. Fuck. Damn it. It's just a fucking many of them. Oh, I now got to start all over again. This is bullshit. Alright, let's get a bit more efficient with the guns then. Fucking assholes. Shit, look how many reinforcements, man, they just keep compiling on. Right, so now we've got to come Trevor. <laughs> Getting in close. Shit. 
shit, now the cops are showing up. Follow Lamar. Shit. Where the hell was Lamar? <coughs> that was a long fucking battle, man. Oh, that's pissed me off. Oh, all the way again back here. Come on, man. <coughs> I should have had a fucking checkpoint. This is shit. Come on. Lame ass hmm. <coughs> Lame <ass. coughs> Come on. Right, this is Lamar. Come on, you fuckers, die. You're driving me fucking nuts. Oh, hold on, we got some uh, long range distance shit. Now we're following them all. Here we go. Shit, let's get the fuck out of it, man. The fuck? Ooh, got some jet skis. <laughs> All right. Damn, it's stink in this motherfucker. Shit ain't no river, man. It's a motherfucking sewer. Then we're in the right place. Look at that. Okay, I cannot do this and shoot. Yes, I don't believe we can, or I can. So I'm just gonna have to follow Lamar. Why the hell was there a girl on it?
Let Lamar and that go first, man, because I'm chasing them. I don't know where I'm going. So we going to land or we just gonna split up? I don't know. <laughs> hey, weird dude, let's get out of here. Kid, follow me, all right? I'll get us out of this. Shit, where are we going? Escape the cops with Lamar. Oh, fuck's sake. Find the ride, what? <coughs> we need a ride, dog. I know we need a ride, but uh, we ain't got no ride. We have to find one. <laughs> Shit, come on. I hate these fucking police. That's a fucking dead end. Information, let's do this. Shit, this is gonna be a long last run. Let's go, man. Ah, oh, shit, come on. Isn't there a fucking exit out of this area? I don't fight. Come right next to me. Ah, right, here we are. Drive me fucking nuts. Alright, alright, we cool. Drop me off around the way. Do, 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 do. Go to Lamar's house. Ah, well. What's going on? Oh! Tell me something. What's that? Why aren't you like head to foot in green with the ball that's like head to foot in purple? Man, that's old school, man. We don't do that shit no more. Oh, yeah? So how you know what side someone's on? Man, you just know. The ballers might wear a purple hat or like a shirt with some purple in it. Or maybe like a hat with a B on it for the baller shit. And you know how we get down the families. We rock the Fuge hats with the Fs on it. You know what I'm saying? Or rock the green kicks with the green laces. Okay. Man, everybody already know who everybody is. It's just the law to say certain gang insignias make you part of some vast criminal conspiracy or some shit. They just want to hit you with that Rico charge. So, am I like families now? Nah, homie. You, you, you just a weird, crazy dude. <laughs> what the fuck happened to Franklin? So I want to know. But I love the fact that he caught out that guy. That he only had a part of it, and it was like the rest of it was drywall. That was pretty fucking funny. <laughs> Ooh. Just drop me here, dog. Later on, crazy dude. See ya. Mission passed. Hood Safari. All right. I wasn't too bad. I didn't enjoy <coughs> that longevity of that fucking mission, though. Or the shootout. That annoyed the fuck out of me. But other than that, it was alright. <coughs> Actually, guys, I'll better check the timing of this video before I decide what to do next. <coughs> I 
wow, 50 minutes? It didn't feel like that. Well, it felt like it was 20 minutes or 25 minutes. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it here then. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Links are in the description below. Uh, <coughs> not too, too bad. We've got two missions done. One main mission, I feel. And uh, that mission was just a bit of a side mission, I feel. But, uh, you know, next time, I don't know what I'll do in the next video, actually. It depends. I might check out that B. I'm not sure. Anyway, guys, I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Okay guys, basically I went into go to save the game at my safe house and then it popped into a story mode. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to say watch this and then I'll just save it anyway. Is a good guy. He's like family and got kid and he's going. That, 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 that's it, right. Yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. And... Uh, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's gonna leave me. I mean, this is her place, and the fornicate? There's Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa, whoa! Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, he died a noble death, bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. Some girls laugh when they. <laughs> Show me! Show me! I don't want to. Well, I don't special, but this boy gets the job done. All right? Now, Wade here says that you work at the docks. Yes. Look at me! Can you just put your Johnson away, sir? <laughs> yes, I work at the docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there to put these on. We are going for a ride. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. Run, we got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm gonna send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it, and I really miss it. Alright, so they want me to do a job. For fuck's sake. I don't want to go home and go to sleep and then save the game. Ugh. Well, you can fucking wait. Fuck this. You know where the port is? Right. Where was I? There's a damn bedroom in this place. Oh, wait, hold on. Is this the right bedroom? Hmm. Guest bedroom, probably. Oh, what the fuck? I just want to fucking save the game. <sighs> I must be his wife or girlfriend or whatever. <coughs> oh, that sucks, man. We've gone right into a story mission. Hold on, what's this? I don't want to browse the fucking net. I want to go to sleep. Fucking retarded game. <sighs> this is bollocks. Fuck it, I can't even... I, I'm really pissed off. I might just fucking quit it anyway. Fuck it, I'm going to quit this part of the game. And that'll be that. I had the sun guys, but I'm just going to quit it and then probably have to do the shit again. I don't know.